Alright everyone, welcome to another episode of The Nerd Couch. Doing a special thing for Halloween here. Yep, this is our special Halloween episode. Um, we are playing Fran Bow. We are planning on playing it in its entirety. Hopefully. Is this picking us up loud one? Yeah. Oh, okay. Should. Just got worried for a second there. Yeah, we've had a little bit of uh, microphone difficulties. Yeah. It was really stupid. Um, yeah, but yes, Franbo. This game was um, uh, wasn't Kickstartered. I think it was a uh, another crowdfunding Indiegogo. I think, but it was it was crowdfunded. Okay. And they had a demo out, and you know I played the demo a couple of years ago, and I loved it. Um, I actually played the demo on my on my smartphone because oh. it's like for. Uh, Android, iOS, Steam, like all those. Yeah. I, don't, I, I think it's like everything but consoles. <laughs> but uh, yeah, let's go play the game. New game. Yeah, um, fair, obviously. Fair warning, obviously you'll be able to tell by looking at the video, but we're anticipating this to be about four hours at least. We might, uh, we might like cut it into parts, but just upload all of it on Halloween. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, like uh, every hour. <laughs> will be a new video. <laughs> Everything's fine. Everything is fine. Feels like heaven. I see my parents. parents. I'm on pills. They, they look, look happy. happy. I'm not. I'm a little piece of shit. They have a present for me. I, I wonder. wonder. Is it a dog? Is it a dead cat? No. It's a cat. It is a cat though, but it's not it's a dead cat. sweet and pretty. Dark is the deepest night. That's adorable. Mr. Mr. Midnight. Mr. Midnight. Like, I really love the art direction in My this game. My best friend. Yeah, I do like them. This My isn't gonna be the whole thing. Friend. Wait, who's that? We're oh, Aunt Grace, okay. Grace, <laughs> Thanks. Thanks for, uh, yeah. I really like her a lot. She's and the we're allowed to bring cats to this restaurant. It's Friday and my parents are going out. I could just say fucking like no no, no it's well, the cat's so cute. Yeah, Grace it's... takes good care of me. You're having so much fun. Then everything Mr. changed being when a the fire fatty. nation attacked. What? <laughs> Mr. Midnight being a little fatty. It's Monday night. I'm playing with Mr. Midnight. I wish my cat played with Something yarn. Something feels real bad. She doesn't really play. Whoa. Uh oh. A strange creature outside my window. Is it Mephistopheles? I don't like it. It scares me. I don't like it. Get out of my face. I don't like it. Suddenly I hear something. Ooh. The hearies I sound is a... Uh... It's mom. Screaming. Uh-oh. I didn't hear any screams. I want to know what's wrong. A bright light shines from my parents' room. Do we go into the light? I go closer. I don't know. I'm getting very, very on edge right now. And closer. <gasps> Mom? Dad? Oh. Please don't. They did. Oh. Mommy? Daddy? Oh. I think she's dead too. No. <laughs> no, it was the cat. Cats are evil. <laughs> They're always evil, right? Trying to steal your souls and shit. Who knows? Kitty, Mr. Midnight, save me. <laughs> Mr. Midnight's so fucking cute. Oh. He feels bad. But. Is that the right? ant? Oh, it's. It's a Jedi. Fran, please follow my voice. On the count of three, you will wake up. One. Two. Three. Fran, how do you feel? Mm. <laughs> I feel like dying. You want me to do that? Yeah. 
feel like dying. I don't understand why you make me do this. Try to calm down. This is part of your recovery. Oh, it's like that Batman thing. My parents are dead! <laughs> My parents are dead! <laughs> recovery? Don't you get it? My parents are dead! Oh, poor thing. Everything will get better, I promise. Um... Gotta do better, let me go, or nonsense? Nonsense. Your fucking parents are Promise? Dead. That's nonsense. You just keep me here. We keep you here so we can take care of you. Oh, okay. But now, I have something for you, friend. Are we being a sassy little bitch in this? Let's <laughs> be a sassy little bitch. Alright. Oh, really? See the desk? There's a little package for you. Is it pills? It's probably pills. Good. It's from Aunt Grace. Take it. I played this game. Oh, the demo. And this is pretty accurate. Like, okay, desk. This was my mother's purse. Open it. There's something inside. Do I uh, examine, I guess? Dearest Fran, here is the purse you like so much. I thought you would like to have it. When I was thinking about you, I remembered that you like to examine objects and combine them with other things. So, I hope you'll always keep this purse and give it to... Give it... Wait, <laughs> I can't read. <laughs> and give it and all the other things you find to a good use. Never forget that creativity is absolutely the greatest gift you have. Love, uh, Grace. She is worried about you. I'll do I'm worried too. <laughs> I'm worried too because I'm not crazy and still here. Stop it. You're out of control, young lady. I'm so tired of all this. I just want to go to my room. Yes, you can leave, but before you do, it is time for your new medicine. No more medicine? Or what medicine? What medicine? What medicine? It's called Duotine. It will make you feel very relaxed. Nurse, we're ready. Shut up, nurse! <laughs> uh, do you want to be the nurse? How the fuck do you say this doctor's name? Dern? 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 <laughs> Dr. Dern. <laughs> Anything new today, Dr. Dern? Nothing, actually. Same visions as before. Oh, I see. Here, Fran. Take your medicine. I don't want it. <laughs> oh, that's gonna happen. Oh, yeah? We don't have all day, Fran. Take the pills now. I don't feel good. Well, take some more pills. Oh, neat. Yeah. Gee, that's gonna happen. Neat. Oh no. Take her back to her room. <laughs> oh no. And nurse, don't let her take this ever again. Don't let her take this game mechanic ever again. Spoiler alert, it's a game mechanic. Great. Where, friend, though? If you leave the House of Madness... Shouldn't you put a more demonic spin on it? I'll hunt you down. <laughs> Catch you. Yes, yeah, because deeper voice means more demonic. And bring you back to insanity. Kitty. Friend, wake up. Medicine will help you escape. I'll be waiting for you in the forest. I love you. Oh, <laughs> you too, Kitty. So sad. Mr. Midnight, you're the how best. Do, how do we know Mr. Midnight's in the forest? I don't know. Chapter one, my sober day. Oh God. <laughs> She's an alky. Yeah, alright, let's see if I can remember some of the things that they put for puzzles and shit. 
Can you wake up or? Uh, she opened her eyes. I'm still here. Hideous place. I have to get out of here. Alright. I'll get your nose. I'll get it. Locked. Good reason to get curious. Oh, sweet, sweet melody. <laughs> Hopefully this won't fall on a fall on my head when I'm sleeping. I don't want to, I just woke up. Ah, oh, I could sleep for days. <laughs> Couldn't you? I mean I'm pretty tired. I get I get well I'm just saying like in general. Red and tiny, you were hiding from me. Is that the fucking pills? That's fucking fucked up. Hate I the hate monster. The monster. I have to find Mr. Midnight. I have to find him now. I miss my kitty. He hides because he's afraid. He told me that medicine would... Slow? Would... Just show me where he is. Hmm, maybe she just spelled that wrong. I don't know. Maybe. Um... Okay, I got nothing in my thing. Find out it's an examining thing. Oh, what? holy moly! Something fell! Yeah, sweet. I got a thing. I gotta play. Uh -huh. I, I used it to play pirate later. <laughs> All right. Um. So yeah, this is basically, as you can see, a point and click point game. Point and click adventure. Yeah. Oh, friend, you're awake. Good. Yes. <laughs> yes. Yes. Now leave. Now I'm leave. Working. <laughs> working. What a bitch. Wow. I did something. I did something, lady nurse. I did something. <laughs> See, you here, nothing but trouble. What is it? Nothing. Nothing. I was gonna say, don't tell her yet. <laughs> nothing. <laughs> Alright, um... That shit. My, uh... My voice-activated, uh, assistant keeps on being stupid. Towels? Towels? I don't need no stinking towels! My legs are just fine. Oh, are they? Alright, um, we have to get more pills, by the way. I assumed. Oh, a secret box. Shh, man, we're just a little klepto, aren't we? A little bit. Hello, Phil. <laughs> Hello. I'll do, how are you? How are you? Everybody says that I'm sick. I have to find Kitty now. Bye. <laughs> I'm not. I don't. I won't. I'm not gonna. I will only be a sassy bitch to the doctor. They always say that. They're just stupid. Are you leaving tonight? I'll try and find Kitty. Bye. I will if you'll help me. Not, not you, Kitty. Yeah, my Kitty wants to be Mr. Midnight. The only thing I know and know is that is the office key. There's a key inside. The key. The key. Gotta find the key. I saw the doctor write a secret code. Is it one, two, three, four, five? <laughs> I'm sure it's something a little bit Did, more in depth. Did you ever see Spaceballs? I haven't seen it in a long God, time. Remember that one part where oh, the uh I wish. I need to watch that again though. A secret code? To open the yellow door? He doesn't want me to tell you. I was just say who I don't see anybody. Bye. <laughs> God, you can be such a sassy bitch. Who? Him. The demon. He's pointing. Oh, shit. All doors are closed. You are a prisoner of my games. And nobody will help you escape. Okay, bye. Leave me alone. I hate you. Okay, can I do anything? Or? So, she murdered her parents? Maybe. That'd be fucked up. Mommy, daddy. No, I don't want to let my, I won't let that monster stop me. Alright. Okay. Oh wait, no, no, no. Okay, I want to, I actually want to. History. The patient came to Oswald Asylum with his mother, Rachel Bronstone. The boy has developed paranoid behavior, paranoia not yet diagnosed. Treatment. 
Daily Treatment with Dr. Marcel Dern. Dern. Marshall Dern. Marshall Dern. We have... Marshall. We, we have not achieved the patient's trust, and he refuses to be questioned. Age 8. Uh, take note of the... Hmm? What? The year. 1944. Damn. That might come into play. Didn't look at the window. No, we didn't. I wonder if you if you check the window long enough or like enough times, just something like creepy will happen. Probably. Um. Can I talk to her again? Well, I can, but you can probably There's tell her about the happened. window or the curtains. See, you're nothing but trouble. What is it? I broke the curtains. I was trying to look outside, and I accidentally broke the curtains. <laughs> Accidentally, I'll have to fix this. Follow me. Okay, can I steal a thing? Yeah. I'm curious, yes, but the nurse is still in. No, she isn't. No, she's not. <sighs> Fine. Something is missing. Have you seen the hook that holds the curtain out? <laughs> what's a hook? <laughs> what's a hook? Um, what's a hook? Well, I have to go and find something to fix this, you little girl. Was she going to say bitch? Yep. Alright, she's going into that room now. Does that mean I can steal well, a she thing? She went through a door so you can steal a thing. Uh, okay. This is where the medicine is, but it's locked. Ooh. Oh! I'd take it if you can. I, uh... Okay, I'll leave this at... I wouldn't take it. Okay, band-aids, okay. Good. Uh, Dr. Scribbles? Uh, no, uh, eight, secret code don't Eight H? Is that an H? Uh, yep. Eight H? Fran Bo? Delinquent? Is that what it says? Huh. Drawing of the brain. Violent trauma can have a great impact on children, totally changing their normal lives. For example, children damaged by trauma can have mild to severe deficit. Can you spit in your coffee? Okay, I guess not. Did, did you close the drawer? Okay. It closed it for me. I'm just making sure. Like, <laughs> she's got a fucking gun in her drawer. Yeah, that's. Okay, um... I hope somebody loves you. Oh. Can I open the door now? Of course it's locked. Oh, wait. Um, can I do anything with these? Oh, examine the, uh, the medicine. One second. It needs it. Oh. A little box. It's open. Can I examine it? Try using it. Oh. Okay. My pills are inside. I know what I have to crack the code. I so H is uh, eight. eight. So nine? Yep. Pills. Katie told me these would help me. Well, mm. it's gonna be great. Things are about to go sour. Yep. And with things about to be going sour, we will cut this episode here. Just to make sure everything's working properly and stuff, too. And it's also been 19 minutes. Oh, fuck. Yeah. Okay. Well. I mean, we're getting pretty into this. Yeah, cause... it's pretty awesome so far. Yeah, I, I, like I said, I really liked the demo. Yeah, we're gonna cut this. Uh, I will say, see you in the next episode, but it's gonna be just a chain all fucking day. Yeah. So you guys have fun and wait till the next episode. Woo.